What we're doing is having a memorial service for those that have died as a result of crime and the victims have an opportunity to come in and put a special ornament on the tree on behalf of their loved one in memory of them and in honor of them. We miss you, Brian. I'll keep you up in the prayers now. We miss you up in the God bless you. The pain is so strong because of the newness of their situation. So, yeah, you, you'll see all different types. You'll see some folks that'll be here that have been here year after year after year. I think it gives them a sort of peace and it gives them healing, just knowing that they're honoring the individual, the lost loved one. A lost loved one is, I don't think can be explained in words because it's gonna leave a hole in your heart forever. It only softens over time. I'm here every year on behalf and in honor of my daughter. We wanted to remember and honor T uh, Daisy that was killed October 10th, 2010. Really an eye opener, because I mean, you get to hear other stories from other people, and it's, it's a sadness. It's a healing process. I mean, it doesn't heal overnight, and people have a voice to speak out as well, and then, um, they're able to bond with other people and able to relate as well. We're remembering the other victims as well here tonight and in honor because they're not forgotten. They still have a voice and we're doing what's right for this community and here in Amarillo.